I am Professor Akunaya Pearl Opoko. I'm a professor of architecture and currently the Dean College of Environmental Sciences in Bell's University of Technology, Ota. possible to key into the rebranding process um, uh, which is ongoing now in the university. First of all, in the way we dress. We want to be to dress the way we want to be addressed and that is a, 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 a university or a, a college where uh, you have uh, people who are decent and responsible. So we want addressing to also convey that. The other where, area where we are also um, 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 aligning ourselves with the rebranding is the way we, we carry out our work. You know, we are driving diligence, we are driving commitment, we are driving attendance, you know, so that people come to work when they ought to come to work and do their work the way it ought to, to, to be done. You know, our main business here are the students. So also in the way we, we, we interact with the students, we, we are also aligning ourselves with the rebranding because we want our students to see us as role models and uh, we, we have to lead them by example. The way we also interact with them is very, very important to us because uh, we don't just want to, to have people who have the knowledge, we also want people who have the right character and the right attitude to work. So these are basically the major areas where we are uh, uh, rebranding and of course, in creating the uh, visibility for ourselves, the college and the university. We are also try trying to do that through our research activities and the um, collaborations we are you know, exploring with the side uh, context. So these are basically the areas where we are rebranding. I came in as the dean. One of the issues I noticed was that many of the departments in the in the college were uh, had very low student enrollment, and um, we have brainstormed on it, on this, and we are trying to to expand the frontiers in that regard. And we've tried to identify strategies to go about this. One of such is um, catching them young. Uh, started interacting with with students in the in the um, colleges around us. I mean the secondary schools around us to sensitize them on the courses we do, so that they can, you know, be motivated to subscribe to to this. And uh, we've also tried to sensitize our students because we know they also have younger ones and uh, friends and uh, relations who are interested in coming to, to, to university. And through that sensitization pro, pro, program, we, we have seen you know, a, a, a kind of in, increase in the, in the level of students we have. And then another thing we've also tried to do is to leverage on graduates, you know, people who have graduated from this college. We are also collaborating with them you know, in terms of uh, popularizing what we do uh, so that we can get, uh, you know, uh, a reference from them and all that. But more inviting, we've tried to improve on the environment of the college. If you look, you can see it's uh, uh, wearing a kind of new look. 
we are environmental sciences so we want everything about us to, to really be green green in terms of you know a, 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 a very inviting um, environment but we, we don't just want that to be a window dressing kind of thing we are also looking inwards to make sure that our faculty or our, our staff have the right attitude in, you know, when we interact with parents, when we interact with the, 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 uh, the outside world, when we even interact with our students, so that they, they feel uh, uh, this is like a second home and they are willing to you know, bring in others, recommend this place uh, you know, as a place where people can come to study. And then another thing we are doing is that those departments that are oversubscribed, we try to, to cancel the students or the applicants to see how they can come over to the other courses. We're also talking with the JOPEP uh, students, you know, so that they can also uh, consider our courses as some of those courses they can uh, apply to. drive as a college is um, the, the issue of uh, research research and we've al already started this by setting up uh, research hubs within the, the college and uh, we, we are looking at collaborative research you know because uh, we, we want uh, to have outputs that are robust. And we are not just looking at in-house, um, uh, uh, doing everything in-house. We are also looking at collaborative uh, research with uh, the, the outside um, context. And in this regard, we, we have started uh, talking to some companies outside uh, the research institutes outside that are doing things that are relevant to what we are doing here on how we, we can collaborate with them in terms of um, research. And the essence of this is, to, is for our staff to be able to publish, uh, uh, not just uh, uh, publishing anyhow, but publishing in high impact uh, journals so that we can, we, can, we can have the desired uh, visibility, we can have the desired uh, recognition, not just for the college and the staff, also for the entire university. So that's one area we are, we are looking at. Then the other area we are also looking at is um, building up the knowledge base of our, of our students. We, we, we think that the students also need exposure, exposure to new skills that are emerging every day, exposure to new ways of doing things and all that. And in this regard, we've tried to to uh, want, uh, uh, you know, have a kind of uh, interaction with our graduates outside. And we, we also um, um, leveraging on that to have a, a more robust uh, town and gown interaction where our students are exposed to the world of practice through seminars, through workshops, through visits, you know, a, a professional visits or visits, academic visits to professional establishments where they can see real life, how things are being done, the innovations that are coming up every day and how these are deployed in the workplace. And some of the, the issues that bother them, they also have, through, through these interactions, they have the opportunity to, to, to be cleared or to be, you know, to ask questions so that they, they know, understand better what to expect when they live here. So the, the, these are some of the things we are doing. And then one of, uh, another thing we've also tried to do, which uh, we, we hope would, uh, you know, uh, get better with time, is setting up a college a, a students association because up until now, there is no uh, college uh, students association. So we are trying to do that so that 
the, the students from the various departments, because we have six departments in the college, architecture, estate management, quantity surveying, building technology, um, uh, urban and regional planning, and surveying and geoinformatics, so that they don't see themselves as, as uh, um, uh, unique, I mean, individual uh, um, entities. They, they, they should be able to see themselves as members of a team or members of a, of a family, as I would normally tell them we are, you know. So they, they need to work together. And that working together, which is what happens in the world of practice, we want to start here. So that is one of the other things we are also trying to do. And we have we've come to realize and we know only the best is good enough for bells.